Hi, my name is Mike Tice and I teach my face-to-face -face classes at the University of Wisconsin Marathon campus. I also teach for the University of Wisconsin online campus. I will be working with you in an application called Microsoft Excel. We're going to be taking some time and putting together a header and then a footer on this uh, worksheet that we have in front of us here. Not too difficult because we're going to be going up to the insert button since headers and footers are things that you would insert. I'm going to insert and then I'm going to tell it, hey, I'm going to go over here to the header and footer area. Okay. I click my left mouse button and I have a new tab. Okay, I have my header and footer tools and the design tab, and here's the tools on that tab. And by default, because I, well, it wasn't really default, I did ask it to go into the header area. Please note, you've got some options here, different first page header, different even and odd, okay, headers, the ability to go to the footer if you want to, and then some other options that seem somewhat uh, synonymous over here to the far left. I'm going to take and I'm going to just tap a little text here. In, uh, this is a header, okay, just to have something up there. Now I'm going to take advantage of the fact that I can go to the footer and I'm going to click on that. It's going to take me down to the bottom of the page and I'm going to Tell it that I want to take advantage of some of the design features here again. And I'm going to take a look at putting page number in. Okay. Okay. Now I have my header and my footer in. Pretty, pretty easy way to go it and do that. And I am going to take my file and I want to take a look at print preview and I see it's kind of hard to read. I realize that I can't really zoom in too much. There's my header and there's my page number down below in a footer area. Okay, let me go back to my file and scroll up here a little bit. Okay, here's my header where my mouse is moving around, kind of confusing everything. And I will scroll down to the bottom of the page and there is the page number in the center of the page. Quick way of doing inserting a header and a